Yeah? Oh, I'm so worried you were going to be late. We have to leave in 20 minutes. Looking for your earring? Mm-hmm. Oh, just look at you, my little Huck Finn. Mom, I'm Tom Sawyer. Oh, Kevin's mom is here, Ricky. Hurry! Wait a second, Ricky. Aren't you forgetting something? Thank you. Mm, don't forget your brother. Bye. Be good for your teacher. We'll be in the audience. While you're in the kitchen, the light over the stove burn out. I almost forgot. Do you know why someone who works for a college would be calling here? <laughs> they seemed to think that you were going to be starting classes there soon and wanted to know when you'd be coming into town. Aha! They sounded like they were an awfully long ways away. But I told her she must have the wrong number. How does this look? Is it too dark? It's too dark. It's fine. It's good. You look good. Ricky's father never liked it when I wore lipstick. Something's wrong. No. There you go, handsome. <laughs> that looks much better. Let's go, honey. There's a little boy who's counting on us. Yeah. Do you think we'll still be able to get in? I think it's already started.
Did Ricky forget something? We need to talk. Well, yes, of course. As soon as we take our seats, we can talk all you no, want. No, we need to talk now. Honey, I don't have time for Mom. this. Look, we're already late, and if I miss Ricky's Mom. performance... Oh my gosh, the tickets. Do you have the tickets? Mom, I'm we... leaving for college. <laughs> what? Now? I, I thought we talked about this. We did, but I've been doing some thinking. Vince, honey, we agreed you'd wait another year. You said that two years ago. Oh, well, what's another year? Come on. No. I'll call. Next up, we have Ricky Ellis performing his monologue from Tom Sawyer Abroad. It's a matter of proportion, that's what it is. And when you come to gauge a thing, speed by its size, where's your bird and your man and your railroad alongside of a fleet? Now that's a, now that's a, now, now that's a common ordinary third class flea's gait. But if you take an Italian first class, that's being the pet and nobility all his life. <laughs> 